Okay, another math video from AlgebraTestHelper.com. And what I want to do here is show you how you can answer some of these percent questions using an equation. And uh, this is actually, I, I really like using equations uh, to help me out answer, uh, in answering percent questions. But um, before we take a look at this particular question, how to solve it, let's just review a real basic type of percent question. So what if we had 15% uh, of 60? What if you wanted to know the answer 15% of 60 is what? How would you do that? Okay, well that's a real direct type of thing to do. 15% uh, of 60, remember what we do is we change a percent to a decimal by moving the decimal point over two places to the left. So this would be 0.15 and then we multiply it by the number we're trying to find a percent of. Okay, so 0.15 times 60, when we do that in our calculator we'll get our answer. Okay, so that's how you find a percent of a number. Now not all your questions are going to be that basic when you're talking about percent. And by the way, if you if you uh, if you don't quite understand that, you might want to go back to our site, AlgebraTestHelper.com, and do some basic percent review before you look at this particular problem. But here we have 15% of what number is 300. So what this question is really saying is, listen, I have I want to know 15% of a certain number. Okay, so remember I'm going to take that 15%. I want to make it into a decimal, 0.15. Now, I don't know what this number is, okay? 15% of, of some number, I don't know, I'm gonna give it a variable x, but, fifth, but 0.15 times whatever that number um, is, is going to be equal to 300. Remember in algebra, this word is, right here, is the equal sign. So 15% of this mystery number x is equal to 300. So you can see here, here's my equation, 15%, okay, that's 15% as a decimal, of this particular number x is equal to 300. So I have a nice little equation here I could solve. 0.15x equals 300. And to solve that, all I have to do is divide both sides of the equation by 0.15. So let me get my calculator out. So 300 divided by 0.15 is equal to 2,000. So x would be equal to 2,000. So let's go ahead and check this real quick. Okay, what if I said, what's 15% of 2,000? All right, so you would you'd be like, okay, that's easy. I'm just gonna go ahead and take that 15%, change it into 0.15 and multiply it by 2,000. And let's see what we get, okay? Check it on my calculator. You get 300. Okay, as you're supposed to be, as you're supposed to get, right? Because that's what we had right here in the original problem. 15% of what number? Well, now we know that that particular number is 2,000. 15% of 2,000 is 300. Okay, so I really like this method. There's another method that you can use to solve percent uh, questions like this uh, that's using proportions, which is a great method also. But um, if you want to learn that and some other things, head on over to our site, algebratesthelper.com. Have a, uh, it's all free. I have a ton of free videos, tutorials, all designed to make math easy to learn. All right, so good luck and take care.